What if your jet tore apart at 70,000 feet and you were sucked straight into the sky? It was 1966. Captain Bill Weaver was flying the fastest aircraft ever built, the SR-71 Blackbird, a jet so fast it could outrun missiles. But that day, something went wrong. At Mach 3.2, more than three times the speed of sound, a sudden failure ripped the jet in half. In a fraction of a second, Weaver was thrown into the upper atmosphere, 70,000 feet above Earth, a dirt with no control, no consciousness, and no oxygen. At that altitude, blood boils instantly, but somehow, his pressure suit sealed just in time. He regained consciousness, floating alone, spinning violently, falling toward the desert. He tried to pull his parachute, nothing. Then, as if fate intervened, it deployed automatically at 15,000 feet. He hit the ground hard, alive, but barely. When rescue teams found him, his jet was scattered across miles of desert. But the man who flew faster than missiles had survived the impossible. Bill Weaver became the only human to fall from the edge of space and live to tell the story. Because sometimes, even when machines fail, the will to live doesn't.